Hello, music community. Well, I just arrived in downtown Riverside. Uh, there behind me, you see the beautiful Fox Theater, um, Fox Performing Arts Center for Performing Arts, something like that. Anyway, the reason I'm down here is because today is Saturday, and it is time for uh, the second um, in the Empire Record, Record Collective show um, this year. So, very cool. Anyway, let's get going. Cause... bag of stuff here excellent and there's more to be had
stack. <laughs> wow. Now to walk back to the car. This time I did bring a bag, as you can see, so... Um, yeah, that was basically a must. I killed myself uh, earlier this year uh, trying to get my records to the car, so... Well, <laughs> I overshot where I parked by about two blocks, and um, yeah, so it was a bit of a walk as you can see. Anyway, let me show you what I got. Uh, we have uh, George Thorogood and the Destroyers. Um, let's see, this is better than the rest. Uh, Booker T and the MGs, melting pot. I couldn't remember if I already had this one, but this one's in great shape. So, uh, London Town. Wings. Uh, Kansas, two for the show. This one, I, I just I just couldn't pass it up. Um, he looks kind of like a wild guy. Um, <laughs> so it's Preacher Jack. And it says here, uh, just briefly, Preacher Jack is a wild man on piano. He's a Baptist barroom boogie-woogie preacher with rock and roll soul. <laughs> oh, man. I managed to pick up, I think... Two or three uh, Freddie Hubbard, so this is uh, Mistral. Very cool. And a shout out to uh, Mark Mai. He loves uh, Freddie Hubbard. Steve Winwood, self titled. Um, I don't see a copyright on it, but fantastic stuff. Uh, here, I don't think he watches my channel, but um, a shout out to, uh, ah, I'm drawing a blank. <laughs> oh, I feel bad now. Uh, Eric Satie, um, I'm not even going to bother saying the name. Um, Roger Coleman. Sorry, Roger, if you're watching. Oh... Oh man, the bargain bins were good to me. Uh, Donovan, Cosmic Winds, no, Cosmic Wheels, I'm sorry. And th this one has crazy packaging. Since I'm in the car, I, I'm not gonna bother showing it to you, but um, 
maybe I'll focus on a couple of these in another video showing the packaging because I got three or four with interesting packaging. Love Harry Chapin. So Harry Chapin, Greatest Stories Live. Anyway. Here we have uh, Harry Chapin sequel. By the way, this is not going to be a quick and dirty video. <laughs> I'm sure it's already well over uh, 10 minutes. <laughs> I saw this at a in a $3 bin. Um, Tommy Two Town 2. Um, and then uh, I passed on it and, and then I found it for cheaper. So that was cool. I'm, what can I say? I'm a, I'm a fan of the Osmonds now. Uh, I couldn't remember if I had this one. I don't think I do. I know I haven't purchased it for myself. I, I may have received it as VCLT. But anyway, here's uh, the Osmonds. Um, it's self-titled, it looks like. And it has, uh, he ain't heavy, he's my brother. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, this is one I... I see in the VC um, complete blind buy for me though um, but thrilled to find it in a, a bargain bin camel uh, the single factor this is another one that has very interesting packaging uh, the Alan Parsons project um, a stereotomy and just a quick preview the picture changes depending on what side of this bag you ha you have it on that's very cool very cool bargain bins a uh, Jethro Tull the broadband no I'm sorry the broadsword and the beast I picked up a couple by Yes. Uh, this is Drama. Whew. I'm tired. Uh, Relayer. Oh, I was so thrilled to find this in a bargain bin. Oh my gosh. Tarkus. Uh, that's uh, <laughs> Emerson, Lake, and Palmer. I just assumed you know who it is. <laughs> I couldn't pass this one up for cheap. Uh, Journey Departure. It has uh, any way you want it. Uh, finally! Uh, who was it that, that was showing the Ventures? I don't remember now. Um... Someone was was showing the ventures. I want to say it was Craig, but I, I could be entirely wrong. Anyway, the ventures in space. Very very cool. Here's another one with very interesting uh, packaging. I think that makes about three. Uh, Jerry Lee Lewis, uh, the session recorded in London with great guest artists. Yes. Uh, let's see if I... Um, I'm not picking anyone out right off the top there. Um, <laughs> thrilled to pick up the knack, uh, but the little girls understand. Very cool. Just a couple more. Um, one of the few jazz records I was able to pick up, um, Tatum Hampton Rich again. The Tatum Group Masterpieces. Thrilled to find that. And 
<laughs> uh, I was watching so many videos the other day. I don't remember who was showing it. Again, it, it could have been Craig. It could have been someone else. Um, I'm thinking of someone else, but uh, the joy of cooking. Oh, I, there's no one after that. Uh, joy of cooking. Yes. That's the first for me. And this is self-titled. And the last one. I believe to complete my collection. Uh, this, you know, it's not the best copy, but it, it's it's pretty good. Um, Gamma 3. So I have 1, 2, and 3 now. Very cool. Whew. Wow. And as you can see, I wore the popper shirt for the occasion. I very briefly looked at um, uh, 45s. You know, it... To me, it's, it's it's almost not worth digging through them to find the few things that I would want to get. Um, I, w I was sad that I didn't find any monkeys, um, but I I basically stuck to the bargain bins. I started out just looking at the regular bins and like 15 on up, and uh, you know. <laughs> I have music to buy <laughs> so I didn't opt for that but um, went to the bargain bins found one dollar two dollar and three dollar bins so I, I think I did pretty darn good yes anyway whew, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time